Karen McAvena, is this Antrim Football Championship ever going to end? Uh, I'm not sure, but it's very exciting. Great football. Everyone's uh, competitive. There's probably about six teams at the start of the season you would have thought could have won it. And it just shows how tight it is that even in the. We've had semi final replays, quarter final replays, and now a final replay. So tight as a drum. There was plenty of support out today for both teams and for the Miners. It was a great occasion. Yes, uh, Miners was, was a great occasion. I'm sure Cargan were probably hoping to go down the road with a double, you know. Uh, to be truthful, uh, three well supported clubs are uh, in the bridge and that coming over. So it, it, was, it was good to see, you know. And do you think a draw was a fair result in the senior final? I do think so. I thought the fir- as a neutral, I thought the first half was uh, Lab Jar pulled away. You wouldn't expect that, to be honest, so much. Uh, Cargan pulled it back in the last two, three minutes of the first half. But it was a wee bit flat. The second half is all you wanted off as a championship match. And to be honest, the goal was very well taken. It just really threw the cat among the pigeons and laid the game up. Who do you think will be happier to get out of here? Well, I mean, Love York would have had the tired legs. I, I personally, people would have said that. I personally think you can't beat playing matches, you know. Uh, so, I mean, next week, there's... Uh, then everyone's equal, I suppose. Cargan were maybe off the boil a bit, maybe they thought, because they didn't have the matches while waiting in Lab Jarg. Lab Jarg made a thought in their head, thought they had tire legs. So that's all done and dusted now, and it's uh, an, an equal match next week. And finally, as chairman, you must be delighted with the effort that went into today and things like the programme, the organisation, Corrigan Parks and John's. I mean, you'd be happy to do it again, although you're asking people to make voluntary effort again. Well, uh, Nave Owens and John's always produce a good show. Uh, My friend, Nal Murphy, actually uh, complained to me about... uh, about the programme so I give him a job and he uh, was headed up the programme so uh, more who now uh, <laughs> so there you go don't ask for a job don't <laughs> complain you make it a job in Antrim you know I'm just sad that you've lost your power in the last couple of weeks you know <laughs> yeah. well that's it uh, you know, I always know I always know that there's people are uh, like a Sean or a PO, PRO and all give great coverage on yourself uh, the, the hits we've got over people I've uh, been in Radio Radio Kerry <laughs> RTE BBC you know uh, Irish News etc so great coverage for the, the good football that's getting played in Altrim with them up.